I'm Chris. Thanks for watching another episode of Southern Lifetime. So today, um, I really came down here to set this hog trap, but I'm gonna do a little squirrel hunt too. So uh, I may go sit in a stand for a little while and still hunt like that. And then if I don't see anything, I'll probably um, walk a few trails and then set that hog trap so yep that's about it um i need to move a camera too i didn't get to do as many hunting videos this year as i wanted to yep uh it's kind of it's kind of challenging and i'm learning on those days when i don't when i go hunting i got the camera equipment but i didn't see nothing or or maybe that day I was looking for a buck, so I didn't shoot the doe, but especially the days where I'm out there and I don't see nothing, I don't know, do people want to look at that? <laughs> so, yeah, it's, I'm learning. I guess videos like that, I can chunk them together real short, shorten them up. Don't nobody want to see a bunch of nothing, so. I don't know, maybe y'all let me know. Give me some ideas. I've been thinking about doing some product reviews. So, yeah. But I'm finna walk down this trail and go in here and have a seat. Let's see what we can see. crazy how you can go deer hunting you know you ain't squirrel hunting then but you go deer hunting be sitting in this stand right here and squirrels be everywhere <laughs> playing all around and then when you specifically go squirrel hunting well it's like they know you there for them then yeah we're gonna post up right there
Yo, that's crazy. It was two squirrels over there on the tree. I know I killed one. I guess I need to... I thought I was going to be okay. My gun had been perfectly sighted in 25 yards, but I guess when I added this adapter on there, I thought it was going to be okay, but I think that threw it off just a little bit. So, But anyway, I shot one of the squirrels on the ground. And I've been sitting here for quite a few minutes after that. And another squirrel just fell from the top of the tree, fell dead on the ground. <laughs> so, I guess I'm, I don't know. I got him, but I must didn't get him too good and it took him a while to die. Yep, I seen the first one I seen. I couldn't get I couldn't get turned around on them fast enough. I'm out here today, I got my Marlin. It's called a Marlin 60. A Marlin 60 SS. It's the Marlin 60 model. The SS stand for stainless steel, so I brought it out today. I'm gonna get down, get these two, and uh, I guess I'm gonna try another spot. So, yep, let's go get them. All right, I got some squirrels on the ground dead over here. Go get these up. Yep, there's a one. There go one. There it is, people. The Marlin 60. Marlin 60 SS. Pretty good 22. I like the Ruger 1022. I got one of those, too. I've actually done a lot more with it, but I decided I need to give this one a little work, so... As you can see, it's getting the job done, so. Alright, so I ain't seen nothing at this spot so far. I've been hearing stuff, but must be the birds playing in the leaves on the ground. But, uh, I'm going to sit here a few minutes longer and... I'm going to wrap it up and get ready to set this hog trap. Alright, so I decided to get down. Uh, I need to go ahead and get this hog trap set. I ain't trying to be out here till uh, nightfall. I got some fish at home unthrown that I want to fry, so. Yep. But I got two squirrels. Didn't really see nothing back this way. I seemed like I was hearing stuff off in the distance, but that's about it. So um, 
Y'all stay tuned, man. I'm gonna grab the four wheel and get ready to set this hog trap and then we're gonna get out of here. Alright, there's the trip. Something made it go off when I last said it last weekend, but evidently nothing's in there, so we're gonna try it again. I didn't have a camera right here at first, but now I'm gonna put a camera here and that ought to tell us a lot about what's going on, so let's do this. Some leftover stuff I use for deer hunting that full draw block. Uh, I like using these. Yep, the deer really seem to like it, so I like using them. I'm gonna put it in this hog trap. ATV. I'm gonna raise this door up just enough to roll the block in there. piece of corn on the cob and set it. Sit it with a piece of corn on the cob. Put that in there like that. And now something gonna pull on that corn and set it off. So yeah, I put the food block in there, but they gotta hit that corn to set it off. So yeah. Grab that corn, that door drop down, see the rope. So yeah, now I'm gonna set my camera up somewhere. Find one of these trees to set my camera on.
All right, there we have it. So I'm finna get ready to get out of here, man. That's it. Glad I got some squirrels, got the hog trap set. I'm gonna get out of here, man. I'm finna go home, cook some fish. So thank y'all for watching. And I'm gonna see y'all next time.